This is Jeremy McGrath's last Supercross championship. To my start. He's got his teammate Larry Ward right there in tow. That's just LaRocco. And here is the battle on with Larry the Ward. Former six-time champion. The defending champion draws the cheer. And look at McGrath. He's starting to pull up close now to number four, Ricky Carmichael. The battle is still raging. A new leader. Carmichael on the outside. Tries to make it close once again. Wants to put the heat on Jeremy McGrath. Can you believe this? I can because I've spoken with Carmichael quite a bit and he will not settle for second. Carmichael retakes the lead. Ricky Carmichael, even McGrath retaking the lead, looks back. And look at Larocco. Larocco's getting into the scene. We got a three-way battle going on. Supercross in the 1980s. And Jeremy McGrath takes the checkers for Jeremy. Signs sideways. And we're ready to go. Let's listen to the sights and sounds. Jeremy McGrath in second behind the young Frenchman. Out in front of Jeremy McGrath. These two have hooked up and started that ladder slowly after that eighth place finish last week. Oh, David Villeman feeling the pressure now from McGrath. McGrath to Villeman's 102 point. Those are the fastest laps we've timing. Seen. Jeremy McGrath. He's got him now Bar for a second. McGrath looks back at David Villeman. Would be the first time in his career that he has won twice in the same city. Pure excellence, Jeremy McGrath. A massive chase for third. So the Yahoo Sports whole shot award. Here's Jeremy McGrath. Last lap for Jeremy. The winningest rider in history. The defending in six times. Play for Jeremy McGrath. What a group out front. In fourth, it's Mike LaRocco, number five. Amazing timing, Art. When he, something needs to get done, he can get it done. Right there, critical. He wouldn't have to use that extra energy working through the pack, but here comes Villeman. Go, try to go bar to bar, but Jeremy moving over on the track wisely. Super cross action. Wyndham is all over these guys as well. He's not waiting. Jeremy McGrath will be only one win away from tying Bob Hammond. And the checkers for Jeremy. And Ricky Carmichael, McGrath to the inside. Well, this track from Carmichael's house is so similar to what he rides on. Here comes McGrath with it. Look behind him. Space is growing. Still waiting for him. Jeremy McGrath becomes the winningest rider in Supercross Yamaha history. St. Louis is underway. between Villeman and another rider. Tom, whole shot money too as Villeman has the lead though. That's the important thing right now. A critical pass though. He's right leading here. his 26th lap of the year. But when it comes to laps led this year, 80 laps on the season. That's scary for everybody else in town, but he knows that Jeremy is the dominant guy. and It's intimidating. Number 934. While these guys get close, watch Carmichael enters the corner. Oh, a mistake. And so Jeremy McGrath crosses over. He's about set to get underway. McGrath with a great start. Yeah, great jump, practiced a million starts yesterday and just leaned in on everybody to the inside. Wyndham, he did that in the heat race and couldn't make the move. Here they got a lot more laps to deal with the guys in front of him. Here we go, Jeremy McGrath now putting the heat, heavy heat on Kevin Wyndham. Oh, he makes it. Very creative by Jeremy McGrath and very aggressive sending the message to Kevin Wyndham. Wyndham has not resigned himself to second place at all, David. Now he is still staying in contention. You know, he's pretty solid. 
He's able to acknowledge the fan. McGrath looking at the checkers. The flash bulbs pop. From New Orleans is underway. Jeremy gets bumped. I do was believe. Close too. He was going up and down while Huffman was doing the opposite. He's flying right next to Carmichael. Right behind him has gone off the racetrack. So Wyndham picks up third. Time to glance over to see who they're going to be lapping next. Here comes Jeremy McGrath. He's going to try his hardest to retake the lead. Here comes Philemon. On the other side, he wasn't able to hop the next jump. A rare mistake. Approaches the checkers. They just got that the flag out in time. David Philemon, his fourth race of the year, beating Jeremy McGrath. And Here we go with the 250s. Getting out of the gate first. And if you look back through the pack right there, you guys ride smart. You should be able to take this title tonight. Smooth, so he doesn't get any wheel spin. Wyndham staying right with McGrath. Boost in the points for Kevin to hold down that spot over Carmichael. So no Set to go, the main event from Las Vegas is underway. Carmichael, McGrath right there. McGrath right behind him, and LaRocco a great start. Then Villeman is in fifth. Jeremy McGrath, who this year became Yamaha's all-time winningest rider. And a big mistake by Kevin Windham. He cannot ride a defensive race. I guarantee he's tight. He's riding a little bit better right now. Kevin's riding really good. We did change the tire, he is getting to the wall. And Wyndham and Jeremy McGrath. Jeremy McGrath gets the block pass on Wyndham. Right, he pulled that tear away and he's going, uh-oh. He's <laughs> confident. I see this. Plus, uh, and the checkers for Jeremy. Well, you know, I mean, who's done that? I mean, Richard Petty, when he's got 100 wins, they call him the king. Jeremy McGrath won his seventh Supercross championship, which would be his last. The final round at Las Vegas would be the 70th Premier Class Supercross win of his career. Consider giving us a super thanks and the video a like. We'll see you next time.